So my name is Darren Cheek, I'm Artistic Director of Damn Cheek Theatre Company. Uh, we're a community-centred uh, theatre company, which means that we do work with the community rather than, than work at the community. And that's very much kind of what the heart of this project was. It was very much about, and it was created during pandemic, so it was very much, the heart of it was about accessing community, reaching community and trying as hard as we could to get community to still keep working together, being together, creating together during what was a really, really difficult time for, for all of us. This is home, yes, home, where I please to be. Home for us all in the North Country. Home for you and you and you. Jamila! Hey! Passion for a Planet, which is a multi-faith exploration uh, of the creation stories and with an absolute environmental and ecological heart. Um, and Christchurch in Felling was absolutely the, the right place to do it because um, the people that run that church uh, are just, they're on the ground, they're in the community. They're about bringing people into the building and using the building in lots of different and creative ways and about people using the building rather than the building just, just being there. So it really was a, a beautiful space to be invited into and, and welcomed into. No, 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 a creation. How the world started. Oh, how oh, you mean the creation? Yes, the creation. The creation. We wanted to be part of the community and let them see that the church is part of the community with a responsibility for looking after things and get involved with them. We have got a good relationship with the local school and bring that into it and that was a good start. We'll grab a, a pot of seeds, there you go. Yeah, well we've both been involved with the community for years on the local residents, um, both being governors of the local Brandland Primary School. So community is very important to us and it's not just about church for an hour on a Sunday, it's church out in the community, that's where we need to be. It's had quite a lot of impact on the school because the, the children really engaged with it when they came in to make the masks and they're really engaged with that. It give a bit of freedom. When you meet people in the street and talk about it and that, and quite a few have come from the school. Human beings, says the fox, worry far too much about how we came to be here and not enough about where we're going. It's the creation stories. So uh, not only is, the, is it kind of the faith-based creation stories, but it's about how we create as people, as adults, getting back into our child and being able to just be silly and be free and play and, and create. So it's creation on, on, on all of those different levels. And again, just bringing people from various diverse backgrounds, regardless of age, faith, uh, race, colour, creed, culture, it doesn't matter. This was absolutely just about creating a, a community which and, and leaving a legacy of, of community as well. They've had that little bit of freedom and really let themselves go and they've encompassed it and, and engaged, embraced it. Engaged with it so really it's been really good that way for the community. Mm -hmm. yeah. This project has been amazing. The opportunity to share God's creation with school children, with teachers, with parents, with community groups, um, to open up this space and for people to become immersed in what creation actually is, and then to begin to make those have those conversations about how we move forward, caring for our environment. And that's why I couldn't not be involved. And it's been a pleasure. Have a long your hands to the middle of the out of this project already, there are relationships that have grown uh, between various faith groups, and there's certainly plenty of legacy has been left by this project, which we're super proud of. Welcome.